Electron Beam Machining Electron Beam Machining, or EBM, is a non-conventional machining process used for machining of very hard and brittle materials, which otherwise cannot be machined by conventional machining processes. In electron beam machining process, the kinetic energy of the the electron is converted into heat energy by impinging the fast-moving electron on the workpiece surface. This heat energy evaporates the workpiece surface, similar to the laser beam machining process, where a laser is used in place of electron beam. If you are interested in knowing how laser beam machining is carried out, I have provided the link in the description below, click on the i button to watch it. And if you are new to ADTW, click on the subscribe button below. This video will cover the following about the EDM process. 1. Working principle. 2. Construction. 3. Working. 4. Application. 5. Advantages and disadvantages. Working principle. This machining process works on the basic principle of conversion of kinetic energy of electrons into heat energy. When a high-speed electron impinges on a workpiece, its kinetic energy is converted into heat energy. This heat energy is used to vaporize material at the workpiece interface. This is the basic principle of EBM machining. This process is carried out in the vacuum, otherwise the electrons will collide with the particles in the air and lose its energy. Construction Construction of electron beam equipment is built similar to electron beam welding machines. Power supply. Electron beam machines utilize voltage in the range of 50 to 200 kV to accelerate the electron to 50% to 80% of the speed of light, which is about 200,000 km per second. Electron gun. It is a cathode rate tube, which generates the electrons, accelerates them at a very high speed, and focuses on the required spot on the workpiece. Cathode filament is made up of tungsten, which is heated at about 2500 degrees Celsius, which accelerate the electron emission by thermionic reaction. Anode. Anode is connected to the positive bias, the electrons are pulled towards the anode at very high speed, and, therefore electrons produced by the cathode filament are not diverged from its path. Magnetic lenses. The emitted electrons are both divergent and convergent, the magnetic lens reduces the divergence of the beam and allows only convergent beam to pass to the next stage, thus, a highly focused beam of electrons is obtained. Deflecting coil. The deflecting coil does not allow the beam to deflect, thus forming a high-intense beam. Workpiece holding device. The workpiece is held rigidly on the workpiece holding device, which can move in all three directions, that is, in the X, Y, and Z axis working. When a high voltage supply is applied to the cathode filament, it generates the electrons, this electrons move toward the anode at very high velocity. After passing through the anode, the beam of electron is made to pass through magnetic lenses, where diverging and low energy electrons are absorbed, and only converging beam of electron is made to pass through it, thus forming high quality electron beam. Then this beam passes through the electromagnetic lens and deflecting coil, which focuses the high-energy electron beam onto the required spot of the workpiece surface. The high-intense electron beam impinges on the workpiece, where kinetic energy of electrons convert into thermal energy. And the workpiece material is removed by this intense heat, thereby melting and vaporizing it. And this whole process is carried out in the vacuum chamber. Application of EBM 1. EBM is mainly used for micro-machining operations on thin materials. These operations include drilling, perforating, slotting, and scribing, etc. 2. It is particularly useful for machining of materials of low thermal conductivity and high melting point. 3. For making fine gas orifices in space nuclear reactors and gas turbines blades. 4. Flow orifices in wire drawing dies. 5. It is particularly suitable for producing very small diameter holes, about 0.002 mm. Advantages of EBM 1. Very hard and heat-resistant materials can be machined. 2. Closed dimensional tolerance can be achieved. 3. Produces good surface finish. 4. Heat-affected zone is minimum. 5. No physical contact between two and the workpiece, therefore, there is no tool wear. Disadvantages of EBM 1. Metal removal rate, that is, MRR is low. 2. Vacuum requirement limits the size of the workpiece. 3. It can be used for small cuts only. 4. Equipment cost is high. Hope you have understood electron beam machining process. 
If you are new to ADTW, subscribe our channel to get all latest updates from us. And click on the like button if found this video useful. Also if want more videos like this, then support our work by sharing our videos with your friends.